Good afternoon, good evening guys, welcome to Crystal Be Talking, the only K-pop reacting channel on the whole of YouTube, because the facts, and welcome to a brand new dance I react to, and I am so gassed for this, I know I say this all the time, I know I say this all the time, but I also mean it, but uh, the reason why I'm extra excited for this is because this has been a request from you guys uh but this is gonna be a compilation video this is gonna be a compilation video we're gonna be basically checking out xg uh, move 2 and i think it's gonna be looking at all of their individual videos all in one package video so this will be i think each the clips are around like a minute long each so um yeah if you do like this video make sure you like it let me know who's your favorite one make sure to stick through to the end and then you let me know so then that way i know that you guys are actually watching through also the reason why I'm, i like doing this kind of content is because as a dancer myself with 10 plus years of experience i love not only just checking out K-pop or dance videos, which I just love watching dance videos in general. And I like making content I feel like you guys feel like you can take something away. And also I feel like I could take something away, whether it's learning more about the members, the name, the Korean culture, the dance culture in Korea, or anything else. I don't know, I just like reading your comments. So if you guys enjoy this video, you guys know what to do. So without further ado, let's check this out. So the first one we'll check out, the first one we'll check out will be, uh, what's it called again? Kokana. So we'll check out Kokana first, all right? Let's go. Oh. There's some hot smoke. Hey. 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 Come with the drill music. Go. Nice. Mm. Hey. Stop that. Mm, that was filthy. Right on time with the beat with the boom, boom. This is the thing. You want to be beat killing with these kind of tracks. Let's go. Boom, boom, boom. Hey. Go. Sheesh. What? Hmm. Ah. Hey. Sheesh. Ah. This is what you call lyrical dancing. You want to be dancing to the lyrics. You want people to feel it. Also, I've got my energy back. Who knew two days of sleeping would bring me back? I feel like freaking Bucky. Uh, none of you guys are going to get the reference. But yeah, I feel like I've just been reawakened. Ah! Uh. Woo! Y'all see that? That, that kind of body roll with the adder roll as it's rolling down. Love that. Uh. Hey! It's the swagger as well. Hey. Oh, 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 that beat killing there. One more time. Look at the legs. Yeah. Hey, the bounce as well. Mad groove. That was Kokana. Damn. X guy. All right, look. So, also, I know someone's going to say they're not a K pop group or, you know. Hey, look. When I say I'm the only K-pop channel on the whole of YouTube because of facts, I know I'm not. And also, I do more than just K-pop on here. I, like, I, I originally come from J-pop, from anime openings and stuff like that. Look at the freaking side in the background. So, I'm fully aware of this. Uh, I'm just, I'm just me. So, that was Kokana. Really liked this. Um, I think that was like more on the drill kind of side of dancing. Uh, being from the UK. It's interesting how UK drill and American drill sounds different, but that's a whole different kind of conversation. But I love that the moves really did match the the song. Like, you know, you want to either A, beat, kill, or convey the mood, the energy, the swagger through your moves. And I think uh, she really killed it. Love that. And um, also, I saw a lot of people preferred her freestyle. Um, I think when she was rapping in the last X -Gal, um, well, XG reaction I did. So next is Chisa. Let's go. Oh, okay, okay. It's a slower song. I need to calm down. Ooh, 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 ooh. But I'm loving this whole setup. The shadow in the background, the window with the... F with the lines in that. I had a dream. Oh, did you? I got everything I wanted. You see all the expression that she's saying for the little movements. And if I'm being honest, it might have been a nightmare. Hey, 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 hey. To anyone who might care. Nice. So, here's the thing. Let me pause this. So, when I was in school, uh, this is the kind of stuff that I had to kind of like 
learn to be able to do. Um, I wasn't really a, a fan of it when I was younger because I was like, I want to just pop and do handstands and flip and shit. Um, but like the more body control that like I got from doing contemporary dance, the more I felt like I was able to express myself in uh, in my freestyles. And the thing is with like hip hop, I'll say I'm, a, I'm primarily a popper. Um, but I do, like, I kind of fuse hip-hop, pop and freestyle. Check out my freaking, um, my shorts on here or my Instagram. I have loads of dancing over there. So the reason I'm saying this is because I like the build-up, the, the weight. Some people are afraid to, you know, let the song kind of start. You know, let everyone just feel the mood. So sometimes you got to wait for the first eight counts, either A, because you want to figure out what the fucking beat's going to be, or B, because you want people to, you know, have the entree. You, you, you want them to just start slowly. The start is being the music and then we're just kind of the seasoning to the song, you know? So I stepped off the golden Also, with that shadow in the background, it gives like a bedroom kind of feel. Like she's at home alone kind of thing. Uh, right there, nice. So much expression in her face as well. Jeez. Hey, yo. I don't know what this is called because, it was, like, there's a, there's a certain movement. She was doing at certain counts. So where is it? Uh, I think it's literally around here. Look at the different movements she does. It's kind of like offbeat, but it's almost like she's leading the beat. Look, look at this. She'll go... Down, two, tap, Cheesh! Tight angles. I would say this is closer to animation. And contemporary. Oh! Look at the legs! Okay, I, I feel I'm almost certain that the whole aesthetic at the beginning with the reflection of the window is to convey a bedroom kind of vibe because this song itself feels so personal that when you're performing this, you want to perform this like you're per like it's personal. Like when you're by yourself, you normally end up dancing slowly until it builds up to a hype, until you feel really just out there. So loving like how it started and now we've kind of moved on from that and now she's just kind of like letting loose so let's you're probably wondering why, why am i talking too much i'm a, as a dancer i love this kind of stuff and i also want you guys to feel like you're taking something back when you're watching this nice So smooth of it. Jeez. I tried to scream. And holding that end pose as well. Beautiful. Uh, it's interesting how, like, literally, the first two, Kokana and Chisa, so different from each other, but so expressive um loving loving it so far loving this let me know your thoughts on how you're feeling about this next will be harvey all right oh you gonna do some some whacking some voguing what are we gonna see hey let's go go uh loving that whole spotlight as well there, there, this whole shot right here Ah, well, what would you say this is? 80s? I would say it's 80s. It doesn't feel like 90s. I would say it's 80s. Hey. Uh, yeah, this is definitely 80s. I'm kind of imagining Wham, some Boy George. That's the kind of like sound era I'm kind of expecting. Sound era? What the fuck is that? But you know what I'm trying to say. It's the kind of sound I'm kind of experiencing. Is this Wham? Nah. In heels, okay. <laughs> I gotta get <laughs> It's the loose shirt for me. Woo! Ah! With the spotlight. Hey. Great use of flop. What happened there? Let's bring that back for the culture. We're gonna bring it back for the culture. <laughs> ah! It reminds me of insane when she pulls the thing. Ah! Woo! The flexibility. You 
see how she does to the music there. And da 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 So elegant! Hey! Those hand movements are beautiful. I love that. So when the words are something about funky for me, look what she does with the hands. Nice. There we're going to the lyrics. Oh, oh, oh. And he's smooth on, she might slip. Might be a hazard. Oh, that was fun. That was hella fun. Really like that. Um, I'm really appreciating the difference in every single performer. You know, every single member has their strengths. Um, really kind of remind me of Blue Lock. <laughs> you know, if you're watching this, you, you're here for the anime, but you're going to... You're here for the <laughs> for the dancing. You're gonna stay for some anime references. Next is Hinata. Talk about anime references. Oh, wait. This who would this be? No, nah. this, this sounds like Muramasa, but it's probably not. Just those chords in the background. Nice. Oh, somebody. Sorry about that. I have to bring that back because my computer feels this is getting out of hand. <laughs> nice. That hand control, man. Jeez. Of course, she's going to be doing some tight Oh, she got them angles, huh? Jeez. Ah, the forcefulness of it. Jeez, yes, go to the in. Okay, I have a personal bias because like, I love Titan. I just love Titan. Something about angles and hand shapes and just the different kind of creativity you can get with it. Also, just like, I would love to get into whacking but my coordination is not the best um so yeah i'm really i'm i'm liking it so much i'm gonna bring it back because why not look at this ah. mm, 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 oh. to the sound mm, mm, oh. Jeez. jojo posing in that it's probably not that was fantastic. Really loved that. Uh, as, as I mentioned, me, some Titan, the movements, the expression, and just how uh, most of that choreo was upper body. You see what I mean? Every single performer is different. Every single dancer is just kind of utilizing their different strengths. Round of applause. We're not finished yet. We are not finished yet. The next one we're going to check out will be Jiria. I really want to say Jiraiya, but I, <laughs> I really want to say Jiraiya. Uh, let's go. I wonder what she's gonna do. Baby, look me in my eyes when I tell in my eyes. Just bring her back. I like how she's using more of her body. So not just like upper half or just the legs. Even with the use of extensions. Alright, using my webcam because the GoPro was just overheating my laptop and I wanted to focus on the dancing and not on the freaking quality of the video. Once again, really appreciating the full use of her body. A lot of hip rolls. Them knees. Wish I'd knees as strong as her. So, I don't have as much to say about this style of dance. But I'm sure that you guys would tell me more about like what you appreciate about this style.
But then again, it's very R&B. I do appreciate how comfortable she is with her body and this performance. Nice. All right, next we have Durin. I think that's that's that's, that's her name. So uh, this is the last one. You're a real bitch, light it up, light it okay. up. Okay. You're a real bitch, gon' light it up. Finish with more hip hop. Birthday, gon' light it up, light it up. I'm drunk and a bitch, gon' light it up, light it up. All right, if I'm correct, this sounds like it's Tiger and Chris Brown, but um, I don't know. Well, it's probably let it up, but I don't know what album or when this dropped. So yeah, this is interesting. Okay. Sheesh. Oh, going with a hip hop. Ah, uh, ah, uh, go. Sheesh, I thought you were going to start crumping there. Hey, what? What? Even, oh, the body control. I had to bring it back to this part here because I just really like how she moved her hips to Chris Brown's vocals here. Look. She just works so well. Uh. Go. Another thing I'm really liking about this performance as well is also the way she's using the space. And so it's like almost like a mix of the two of the different styles we saw earlier. Uh, whether, if you know what I mean? So from like the hip hop kind of side of it, because this is definitely, the dance itself is definitely hip hop. It's 100% like a hip hop, I don't know if it's a freestyle, but it feels like a hip hop freestyle, like you'd kind of see like a hip hop battle, especially with like the movements of um, some of the moves that she's doing. I don't know the terminologies for all of the <coughs> hip hop moves, but I'm seeing a lot of them here that would seem hip hop battles, and I'm really appreciating that she's including them in this performance. So, uh, well done. Ah, uh, hey. She's gonna knock someone out of them elbows. What? Damn. You've also got to appreciate the springiness to her knees, the bounce that she's having. She's definitely got that hip hop swagger. This is crazy. Um, so X Girl X are, Jap are Japanese, right? No. Or do they have Japanese members? Because I remember I said once, somebody commented about, oh, XRX, they're not Korean, or it's not K-pop. So I'm like, all right. So I'm sure somebody will let me know down below. Feel free to educate me nicely, of course. Not everybody knows everything. So if I'm asking you to, to let me know, then do let me know. Ah, ah, let it up. Like, this is another moment I thought was really, really cool in this performance. So look how she kind of gets down. Sheesh! Keeping one leg extended and down. Hey, go, go, swag. Sheesh! I wonder if she's in another. X Girl X, was she in, a crew, in another crew before this? Because she seems like she might have come from battles as well. Hey, pure swag. Mmm. All right, that was the last performance during of X Gal X. One thing I can say is that they freaking blow me away. Whether they're doing music, whether they're doing covers, whether they're dancing or doing freestyles, phenomenal, phenomenal. Um, yeah, let me know who are your favorites. Uh, I would say for me, because of the style of dancing I do, I would say I lean more towards Durin and Kokana. But I did like, was it Chisa? The one with the, the window in the back, well, the window reflection shadow. What was wrong with me? Uh, I also like that performance as well. Um, those are the, the three that stand up personally to me. So obviously there is no right answer. So let me know who your favorite three were down below. Hope you guys have a great day. I'll see you guys soon. If you liked the video, thumbs up. Chris will be talking. Peace.